Oh yes, that rain is going to be coming down tonight and into tomorrow. It's going to be very wet out there. I did want to share another photo uh, from a Fox 12 viewer. This is from Karina. She had a dusting in Forest Grove and she shared this on Mark Nelson's Facebook page. So we always appreciate when you share your photos of what it's like from your house. So thank you so much. It was a wide range of just a dusting. Some people didn't see anything this morning. Some people got a few inches in the higher elevations. So um, yeah, it's nice to see that and to be able to share that with everyone. What we're going to be seeing in the coming days are much wetter conditions. Winter Wonderland though, the awesome light show that goes on at Portland International Raceway is open till 11 o'clock tonight so you can still head over there. It'll be cool and rainy. You're in your car though so you'll be nice and warm. Just crank up the AC or the heat rather. It's not the time for air conditioning in any way, but it'll be 35 to 38 degrees. Light wind both nights, rainy and cloudy conditions tomorrow night as well. Here's a look at the radar and you can see the rain is just staying with us. We do have an urban and stream flood advisory. This is through tonight at 830. Lower areas of the freeway too are seeing it gets very, very overrun with the water that's and the rain that's been coming down. So you are going to have to budget a little extra time if you're going anywhere just to be safe. The rain will be with us through tonight all up and down I-5 over to the coast and uh, to the east side of the Willamette as well. So just soaker conditions really. And we could see between now and Monday night, between one and a half and three inches of rainfall. That's a lot. On the coast, it'll be rainy all day, just a light wind. Our temperatures in the upper 40s though. For the valley, temperatures are in the mid to upper 40s as well, 42 in Portland, 48 in Salem. Like I said, a rainy day, heavy at times. So you can anticipate getting soaked just about any time you head outside tomorrow. A little bit different in the Columbia River Gorge. There's a chance of freezing rain in the morning, then a rain-snow mix. There's also a winter weather advisory in effect for the eastern part of the gorge past Pont Bonneville Dam. They're looking up at between two and six inches of snow that could fall there. On Mount Hood, a wintry mix of snow and rain. Past conditions will be slushy. They will be slick all day. Three to seven inches of new snow up there is what we are anticipating. On the eastern part of the state, rainy, chance of snow, 35 in Baker City, 39 in LaGrande, 48 for a high in Madras. Seven day forecast, so rainy and cool tomorrow. That rain is just gonna keep coming down. Tuesday though, something to look forward to, mainly dry. That's the day to get out, finish all your last minute holiday errands. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, those showers return. Temperatures drop really cooling down at night as well, but you can expect wet conditions for the rest of the week.